the sun gives us life. Without the sun, life on this planet would not be possible. We spent so much time looking really far into the universe, but our own star, the sun, is right there, and there's so many things that we don't understand about it. The sun is incredibly dynamic, and there's a number of processes that go on on the surface. Some of them can lead to particles being ejected into space. And when these particles travel to us, they can interfere with communication systems, with GPS systems, they can destroy our satellites and our power grids, which means we're gonna be sitting in the dark. What my team is trying to do is we have images of the magnetic field of the sun for the past 50 years. The images that we have from back in the day are significantly lower resolution than the images that we capture today. And we're trying to use machine learning to increase the resolution and make them higher quality to understand how we might be able to tie that in with effects that we're seeing here on Earth millions of images that we're sending through a network that we're trying to get something useful out of. Without Google Cloud and Intel CPUs, none of this would have really been possible because we wouldn't have had the computing power and we probably would have waited for a whole year for our models to train. But instead, with one click of a button, it takes us five minutes and then our model is done. In a world where we're so reliant on satellites for communication systems, but also we need to understand exactly what makes us vulnerable. I really hope that in the future, scientists will make more use of machine learning to have computer scientists and natural scientists working together on solving the world's biggest problems.